So someone just shared an album of photos with you. Are those photos yours now? No, you're just looking at their photos. They could delete them or stop sharing at any time. If you want them, there are three steps. Save them, find them, and add them to your own album. I want to show you in Google Photos exactly how this works. I'm Chris Gould with Geeks On Tour. First of all, how do you know that an album has been shared with you? Well, on the phone, you will see a notification, the little red bubble, next to this icon, which is the sharing icon, the two little heads. On a computer, the sharing is on the menu over here, and you'll see a little red button notification. I'm going to do most of this on the phone. So you tap the sharing icon, and then you see albums in one row. Here, here are albums that are shared with me. And then here are conversations from particular people. So the one that I'm looking at is the one called My Florida. Here are some photos shared with me by Jim. The album is called My Florida. I tap on it. I'm looking at Jim's album right now, the one shared with me. And if I open a photo, I do not have an edit button. Why? Because I cannot edit his photo. I need to make a copy of it for me before I can edit it. So step one is to save these photos that were shared to me with me to my library. Open the album, and here it is. Save photos. There's a little cloud with a down arrow. Save photos. That's it. They are saved. But where do you find them? I go back and back and look at my photos. I do not see those photos. Why? Because when they're saved to my library, they're saved by the date that they were taken. So they're here somewhere, but how do I know where? Well, the easiest way is to say, I don't know when they were taken, but I know that they were added today. Search. And down at the bottom of search, there's recently added. I know these are not my photos. So all those first group of photos that were added today are the ones that came from Jim's album called My Florida. So I want to keep them in a separate place. So I will select them, long press, and drag down. Actually, those three were mine that I added today. So those are the ones that came from Jim. I tap the plus and make an album. And I say Florida and checkmark. So now I have my photos. These now belong to me. But it is now a copy on my device, and that means I can edit it. I could not edit it while it was in his album. It was his photo then. If you wanted to do this on the phone, it's the same process. It just looks a little bit different. Sharing is over here on the left. You see My Florida, the album that was shared with you. Then you would click on the little cloud with the down arrow to save the photos. Then you would go back and look at your own photos, but use Explore to find Recently Added. Now you can click on the first one and shift click on the last one that are the photos you want. Click Plus, Album, New Album, and Florida Photos from Jim. That's how you get a shared album of photos to be in your photo library. You save them, then find them by using search and recently added, then add them to your own album. You select them all and add to album. 